Yeah. Exactly. Going back when to you, when you're playing games with a man, yeah, you are, like you're playing game of infidelity with a man. You are a married woman. You keep getting pregnant for another man, even to another man. You understand? And you think the other man that you're playing that game with, you think he would respect you, or he will fear, or he would love you, or he will see you as a good person. The day will come when this guy, the, the guy himself, actually had own plan. Like this kind of woman that can do this, you understand? Mm. To another person, you understand? Can also do it to me too. Yeah, exactly. So unknown to her, the father of Adam, he actually had his own plan. You understand? Hmm. Even the business that they were running together, the guy has already sorted himself out, you know, made his own, his own, you know, his own part of it, you know, to sustain himself. To yeah. Because, you see, he knows that he can never ever trust that kind of woman. So at the end of the day, it was frustration and pain that killed her because the father of her five children took all his five children, you know, because he's well and able to maintain them. To maintain them. So she ended up having nothing. Now that's unfair on both sides. <laughs> yeah, because you see, like what we had then, even the man that she had the fact to come in, whenever she comes in and says, she's pregnant, she says, come, why are you doing this? It's too much now, you understand? If I were you, if you're stealing something to Papa, at least you do it gently, two, yeah. Two and give an excuse, but why? It, you know, him so for his conscience is not at all. Mm, it's not. But then, he was a hair. But, but he didn't stop that. anyway. <laughs> He was enjoying it too much to stop. But anyway, going back to what we were saying initially about women so men, men married. Very, very careful. Yeah. And you know, because it's a plan. You see, you see, don't go out there looking for something that is not missing. Hmm. If you are blessed enough to have a good woman by your side, whether you're married to her, whether you're dating her, you understand? Please, 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 please keep to your lane. <laughs> so those women out there, they are wicked, they are mean. Especially for the for the single girls. Now. Yeah. These girls are desperate. They have no dignity. They have no shame. But anyway, let's fo- let's focus anything. today. Flake, let's focus today on the married women because they are the target for today. They are the one yeah. we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> let's leave us the single out of it because... I remember those days in my former church. Yeah. Yeah. And down here about marriage, women, and my pastor was like, he went on the altar to look for me. Say, come on, eh? He doesn't even hear complaints about you. People don't come and fight because of sin. He's only the married Every people. Day, married women fighting that two married women are fighting over another. And man. and you know the oh, the worst thing sometimes they are fighting over a young guy or fighting over man. another married person. Another married and then two married women. <laughs> there's, there's one that we had two married friends, yeah uh, couples. They are married, they are friends, and the two of them actually you know uh, are different uh, for, for each other. Wife. Yeah, yeah. And it, the thing that you know, like I don't for some reason. I'm sorry, uh, sorry for cutting that, short now, for like uh, people have forgotten that when you put something on the internet these days, it stays there forever. You can't. We can't pull it back, and they put their dirty on the social media, whereby everybody can have access they, oh, to it. They're dirty, they're dirty, they're dirty, they're dirty everywhere. Yeah, you understand. And uh, these people have children. You have um, uh, uh, family members. You have you know children who are watching you tell the world how uh, left with your friend's husband and how um, you uh, apparently the, your, your husband is on the father. Come on now, come on. I really, I really, I just, I'm, I, it's just a pity that we have to do all those type of things. We've lost it our morals. So sad. Uh, We've lost our morals totally. I was watching, I had one yesterday, somebody, you know, actually called my attention to it. This one is a man. Mm. He actually went there and he was like, I think there's been a hula ballo about him and um, and, um, a female blogger who actually blogged him for some certain things that they said he did, blah, blah, blah. You understand? I would expect him to even respect himself as a man, you understand? You know? And he went there in order to justify himself. He even went dirty. No, he went, he was like the lowest of the lowest. I, I couldn't expect a man talk that way mm. and the thing he was revealing eh, this one did this this one came to me and said this and I was like come on now and they were even putting the, all this on social women, media even with the women probably you know but was you a man you know yeah and they are putting it on the social media which is yes and really like the, sad. Like the, like the female blogger, she said, look, she is a blogger. That's her job, you understand? To blog. If she sees she this, she blogs it. Put yourself in a place where I would blog you. I blog, I blog you, you there. That is, you understand? So you, I, 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 I don't expect you. don't expect me to show you like, on that level. That's my job. That's what I do. That's, that's what I get paid for. So if you throw your dirty dealing out there, I will wash it for you. you know? <laughs> but then this guy came in, eh, this one called me to say, eh, they want to, ah, oh, man. I was like, even you to a man. Anyway, for like a... It's great talking to you, having a good chat with thank you. you. Um, this is Susanna on the Afro-Caribbean Lifestyle and Achiever, all the way from Ireland here on Carbon Online Radio.
Uh, we've been talking and chatting all the way with Folake Jubil. Folake Jubil, thank you. She's a great mentor, speaker. She's an entertainer. Like, if you want to get your party done, if you need somebody to get your party groovy for you, call on Folake Jubil. You can find her on Facebook, Flaky Tweeties. Just go on, on, on your Facebook, type in Folake Jubil or Flaky Tweeties, and you can get her up there. For your parties, weddings, ceremonies, uh, you do a lot of things for like a, for uh, you. yeah. So f- you do a lot of yeah. things. Uh, I, didn't get, I didn't get you there. I said you're doing. A, I'm telling the audience, people that might be listening to our conversation, that you're an entertainer. Uh, you do a lot of uh, events, MCs with children and adults, weddings, uh, birthday party, different type of things. Yeah, do you want to tell the people how they can get you? What's your contact with them? AKA Flaky Twinkles. Yeah. <laughs> I do entertainment. I do um, MCs at weddings in, in all events. I do children's parties as well. I'm also a party entertainer. I do um, fashion shows, which you, Susanna, is also well. Yeah. Wear. Yeah. And um, I'm also more or less like, wait, look, uh, she's a I'm motivational not- speaker. So I do a lot of things. And then uh, professionally, I work, um, I'm into supported teaching. I do learning support teaching. I work with children with low learning abilities. Yeah. So, um, sometimes with mild and um, educational disabilities. And as well. And then we do uh, youth um, counseling as well, which you, you, you know about. Yeah. So if you're out there and you probably have one event or the other. Coming up. Hello, soon. everyone. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed today's program uh, on the Afro Caribbean Lifestyle and Achiever. This is your host, Susanna, on the Urban Online Community Radio. We'll be back with you again um, next time, but we'd like you to send in your comments and to visit us on our. Facebook page. The anyway, you've been Cover traveling everywhere. Radio. You find you've been the program traveling there everywhere and, and you can drop your in your thing. comments and Love you, baby. let us know what you think about and today's program. To you thank you all now. for listening all and right, we'll see you, you again. Thank, thank you, Hart, with this yeah, wonderful, you beautiful much, song babe. again from yeah. Yemi Alade, uh, one of the top um, African singers, oh. singer songwriter oh. in Thank you. Anything.